YouTube, the final account, is potentially one you need to prepare yourselves for. This is VIP one, so only a tiny weeny 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 bit of money has been spent on this. It's level 118, and it belongs to server 80. So the likelihood is this account got neglected a little bit. Should be an interesting one. 118, we'd expect an E5 hero here and some additional progress. That said, it's from an, an, an earlier server, so goodness knows what it's going to look like. E5 Queen! E4 Garuda. E2 Demon Hunter. Glory Challenge, or sorry, the Glory Chapters or whatever they're called, all finished. Glory Challenge itself, giving us prizes for having an E5 in the Abyss Faction. Which was Queen. First impression. First E5, Queen. Terrible choice. Queen cannot be imprinted. And that means you cannot push her power level as you begin to progress in the early game. And that means she cannot carry you. Also, your golden spirit is horrendous. It's spread very thin. So, that's tough. It's very tough. We have an E4 Garuda that could be E5 if Demon Hunter wasn't taken to E2 because we could have used this Demon Hunter as a 10 star and fed it to Garuda. Instead, we have an E2 Demon Hunter, which I will say, fantastic skin. Awesome skin. However, terrible hero. Used to be great. Silence was very strong. But terrible, terrible hero. So, my first impressions... This is hard. And you want Scarlet Queen Halora. Now, here's a funny thing. You used Queen to unlock the Void, and then you probably got a slap in the face when you realized, ah, 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 I need five million Crystals of Transcendence. Getting those Crystals of Transcendence is very difficult because it requires you to do well in the Void Arc, and it also requires you to do well in the Realm's Gate, as well as the Void Vortex. Forerunner Area 3. Is that the furthest we managed to get? Okay. A Wolf's 145. Let's actually see what this can do. There goes Queen. Oh, she didn't even deal that much damage. Wait, what? Whoa! What the? N what? You've got an energy artifact on Garuda? What are you doing? No! So Garuda needs time to charge up her feathers to do a very powerful active skill. You absolutely do not put a magic source on it because that wastes that. No! No, 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 no. You don't do that. Right, if you're going to put it on anyone, put it on this Emily so she gets a decent active skill and buffs the team and put your Spirit Destiny on Garuda. There we go. Whoo, baby. Oh, stress. Oh, guys. Right, also, Eloise does not need magic source. Carrie does. Let's go with Carrie with that. Uh, then Faceless, yoink. And then, do we have any protective stuff here? What have we got? What have we got? Anything that gives block. Block, 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 block. No block. Come on. Do we have, like, invisible, like, secretly hidden on someone? Uh, wait, was that a fearless armor? You're just chilling with a fi just, just, just chilling. Okay, sure, thanks. I'm gonna pop that fearless armor onto Eloise. <sighs> Let's try again. This may just make a massive difference. And you've got a lot of magic sources. Congrats. That's a good thing for your account. Uh, faceless, nope. Carry, yep. Right, let's try again. Oh, my word. Yeah, so here we go. Let's try it again. There you go. Your active skill from Queen, which is nice. Then you attack back with Garuda. Then she does a basic. That's fine, right? We want these feathers to rack up. The more feathers, the better. Because then when she does her active skill, she hits even harder. So that's going to work in our favor. So obviously, Garuda's going to keep doing things. Beautiful active skill from Emily, buffing the speed and attack of our team. Very nice. Then when Emily dies, even more power is going to go to the team. And here we go. Our Garuda is charged with an active skill, which should be considerably more powerful now. Oh, it didn't even crit. Oh, that's so sad. Oh, my word. What is... Garuda is normally a massive damage dealer, even at this level. There is something frighteningly worrying about this. And this queen is scarily weak. Okay, although it does feel like we might actually be able to get through this. 
Then again, we're about to eat an active skill from the enemy Garuda. Uh, our Garuda is still alive. Oh my word. Carries back. But we're going to get energy stolen by the enemy carries, which basically means your Garuda is going to get absolutely annihilated. Oh, this is bad. Yeah, because there's no way your Garuda is going to get an active skill. And without an active skill, you can't kill that enemy Garuda. And you're going to die. That sucks. That really sucks. Uh, let's go and see if there's anything we can fix about this Garuda then. HP, HP. And it's H... Oh, it's such a HP build. All right, so Garuda needs crit. Um, and she's going to need more aggressum to be a good hero. And we don't have that. So that's something worth considering. Where's the rest of your ranger gear? You re Oh, holy skill. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Where's the rest of your ranger? Right, right. All your ranger gear. Just put this here. Also, hang on a second. Agate Stone 4 for Garuda. Celestial Stone 4 for Demon Hunter. Well, that's... that's Oh, ah. Wait, 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 wait. So have you been upgrading stones all over the place? It uh, feels like it. Why do we have no gold? What have you spent your gold on? And Garuda needs runes power? She needs something, all right. That's what she needs. She needs something. HP, HP is not going to cut it. Uh, uh, you've gone for a damage build. Wait, wait. Damage over time purify? Well, that's not going to help anybody. Well, let's go with mark purify for that specific wave so she can remove carries marks. Um, what's queen rocking? Speed, but she's not going to need that. I feel like you've made this account to wind me up because a lot of your decisions are questionable. Um, that said, that might not be the case, but it, it feels like it. Uh, let's go with... You know what? I'm going to go with resilience just for this one particular wave. And I'm going to try and attack it again. But you said you started off building Demon Hunter? I'd have just swapped. I'd have just swapped that Demon Hunter to Garuda and cut your losses. I'd have been like, yep, nope, I'm done. Right, let's let's try this one fight again. Four runner area three, man. Ah, The fact it's a, an E5 queen is what we're using here. Scares me so much. This Garuda's stone. Like, I'm trying to help. I'm trying to get this cleared. I'm trying to make this team as good as it possibly can be before we even start talking about how to help you in the future. But I think you already know the answer. It's build heroes that are going to help massively. So I, I would probably not even keep this queen around. I would replace this into a wall deck or a Morax. Hey, Garuda got a kill. Uh, this Garuda, that's fine. Get it to E5. She's going to be your main carry hero. Uh, the Demon Hunter, probably swap for a Rogan if you can at some point. Uh, or even just regress, get all the fodder back and just, just cut your losses. Okay, come on. Come on. Come on. Let's go. There we go. We've killed Ada. Now it's all down to Queen, Eloise, and Garuda to finish the show. And we get energy stolen by a carry basic on our Garuda. Absolutely annoying. Right, come on. Yes! Let's go! Puck champ! We did it, boys! Forward area two. <laughs> oh, man. You know what? Tiny victories. Tiny victories. Anyway, let's go back. So, Shadow, we don't really have anyone we've got. We've got a Ticks, that's it. Um, Fortress, we have one Anosuke. Abyss, one Waldeck, one Delacium, one Morax. A load of other Queens. In fact, if you've got that many Queens, I would totally replace this Queen. Uh, Forest, way more Demon Hunters. Yikes. And do we not have the other Garuda copy? No! Oh, my word. So, we don't even have enough for an E5 Garuda. Do we even have the 10-star food? Do we have Emily copies? No. In the bag? No. Oh, wait. So this Emily is now just stuck at 9-star. So what we want to do is go ahead and 10-star this Emily. The fact you've gone and 9-starred Eloise is painful because it means that a lot of food that could have been used in the Shadow Faction has gone to waste. Same with everything you put into Demon Hunter. All those heroes are now out of reach and you can't use them for imprints or E5-ing heroes. So you will have to swap Demon Hunter at some point. What about Faceless? Please tell me you have two copies of Faceless so we can 10-star Faceless. We have one. You know what? One is better than zero. That's... That's fine. One Faceless away. We'll 10-star Faceless. Then we'll get a Garuda copy. We'll E5 Garuda. And at least we'll have Unbending Will on Garuda. And that's where we're gonna go. And then after that, you're gonna need something that's gonna complement you here. Let's have a look at your guild tech. I'm gonna guess warrior tech is awful considering how that Garuda was performing. Uh, yeah, warrior tech isn't finished. So warrior constitution and warrior mind need to get leveled up. Oh, why did you upgrade block? And oh, okay, okay, okay. So one really common thing I see 
is people just go around the guild tech tree like this. Just go 10, ta da 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 Nope. Literally get to 10 and move on. Like skill damage, you should have got to 10 and moved on. Block, get to 10, move on. Crit, that's fine. Attack, fine. HP, fine. Speed, you were right. You got to 10 and moved on. Constitution, get to 10. And then bounce between constitution and mind, whichever one's cheapest. But you did not need to get block up to... Um, as highly as you did. What about Ranger? How's that? That's maxed. Okay, that's good. Ranger maxed is fine. That's going to allow Queen to perform better. And arguably, you do want to be pushing more heroes. We want to be getting ourselves down the line of having more Rangers. So Eloise, you've got three copies. We can potentially pick up more. We've got one there, so we could have a 10-star Eloise at some point. It's going to take time. Do not focus on Eloise. Do not upgrade this Eloise. Don't take her level any higher. Don't you dare put a stone on her. This Eloise is to sit there and just be a 9-star for your team until eventually you can build it as your third. I want to stress that. Third E5. Garuda's going to be your second. Then build Eloise. Then maybe a Penny. Penny would be pretty cool here. So try and save some Penny copies. And then the account's going to look okay. It's going to look even better once you replace the Demon Hunter for a Rogan and Queen gets replaced for someone like Waldeck. Problem is, that's going to cost a lot of soul symbols. Let's look at the bag. How many soul symbols do we have? Uh, zero. How many scrolls do we have? Uh, zero. We have a free summon, though. Uh, your hero list is full. Never mind. How many summons have we done this event? 144. Stop. Stop at 100. Stop at 100, real Satan. Stop at 100. I feel like you pushed too hard. Don't. Just use scrolls willy-nilly. I know it's a scrolls event, but you can't just throw every resource you've got at this. As well, let's look at your profit orbs. Zero! No! How? How have you done 100 summons? Got four profit orbs. No, how many profit orbs? Six profit orbs! And then used them this week. Save for events! How many times do I have to say this? Ah! Balls! Ah! Sorry, I just had to get that out my system real quick. But man! Ah! No five stars! That's fair, that's fair. To be fair, it is the Halloween event. You've probably used five stars for this guy. Wait, wait a minute, you've been... No! No way! No! 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 Oh! You you bought six of these? Oh! Oh God! I'm done. End of end of episode. This account has got to be. This has got to be a troll account. No way! That is negligence of the highest degree. You know. You should have gone for other things. You could have even had a skin. Or a nine star puppet. And you chose six five stars. Six five stars is a six star hero. When you could have had a nine star puppet, which is like 27, 28, 29. I don't know the exact number. Heroes. Oh my lord. Nope. I'm sorry so much. I, I don't apologize to me. Either apologize to yourself. Like, I'm just criticizing here. Like, I, I can't even be constructive. There's, there's nothing to say apart from why. Did you not watch the event review? D where I was like, yo, buddy. These are the things you should get. These are great. Maybe go for the nine star puppet or get the skins if you're into collecting skins. Uh, at least you bought these. That's nice. We got the witch's potions. How far did you get? Four. Four. Wait, 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 wait. So you, you, you're trying to get to 300. I respect that. You know what? I hope. I hope you get to 300. Because you know what? If you can do 300 summons this event, you're not only going to get some more rewards and an imminent chest, you're going to get a core of transcendence and we're going to get ourselves a soul symbols and those soul symbols will be 
truly marvelous for this account. <sighs> but yeah. Why does he have 41 relics? I don't know. I don't want to know. But he has 41 relics and no artifacts. So yeah, final point. Use your relics for the glorious boost to buy artifacts. For 400 relics. Don't go, ooh gee, look there's some artifacts here. I'd love a Sword of Justice. That's so much cheaper and it's getting me attacking holy damage. Oh gee, and it's an orange one. That's way better value than a golden crown. Oh man, I'm gonna buy that one. No, 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 no. <sighs> Either way, that's, um, that's the account. E5 Garuda, finish Eloise. And let's try and get a hero from the Fortress faction. <sighs> wow. It has been a while since I got that triggered by an account. Well, guys, twitchy fingers strike again. <sighs> it's the biggest problem, honestly. 99% of people that make mistakes in this game make them because of impulse and twitchy fingers. <sighs> and it happens all the time. So hopefully you guys can... Be a little more controlled and restrained, and hopefully so can the real Satan. Hopefully you can do that. And you said you got Balrog with relics? No, you didn't. No, you didn't. You can't get Balrog with relics. Don't tell me he's available. No, you can't get Balrog with relics. You're just lying now. So, get in the bin. Right? Anyway. Uh, I'm done. That account was probably some kind of wind-up. I hope it was. If it was legit, then get some bleach for your eyeballs. But yeah, I'll see you later, guys. That was... That was a time. Yeah. Wow. Happy idling.